Right, back on site. So we've got a, a pair to do here. Started loading it out. The weather's absolutely shit. Got our brick shields on. First time I've used them actually, quite, quite good. But yeah, um, so this is the next next job. Um, like I say, semis, I think it's like a big pike on it and that. Three, three stories. So we'll crack on with this, get it all loaded out and then we can start. All right, we're all set up now. I'm just gonna run these cores a block all the way around. Cable here, got the profile set up, all marked up, and then that one over there, it's not running all that in. So I'm gonna just block around first, get the tray set up, and then uh, start on that. So I started getting the brickwork down, the um, wheat vents are in. So what I like to do now is just set up, where have I done that now? Set up my window, so I know my window, there's a little mark there, just to keep that plumb. And then you can do the same on the other side. So sometimes you might need to just slightly alter it, you know, not, not too much, but I look on drawing. Just have a quick look on the drawing, and then you know that it's not going to affect anything. Just here. That's what I do, I just, just measure it out on your first course and then just mark where you need to be and then you write them the same on the other side. So we'll get cracking with this. Um, cavity, I'll give that a wipe out. Push it out and then what I normally do is just knock the two bricks out and then put some SE in, in which is there ready to go. Right, so this is what we're up to so far. We set out these service boxes. put them in once I get up to the top of it so otherwise it starts pushing your line out so I'm just going to cut out this brick and then I can pull that SE in that SE in out there and then you just do that each night and it just clears the cavity then just put, put them on the back it should be should be 4B1 but the joiner goes mad when we take that so we've got 3B1 that's all we can use so Get these cut out now and then uh, we can pull that through. So that's it out there, clean that off. And then all you do then is pull that through until it comes right out and then pull it back the other way on a bit of rope. And then that keeps the cavities nice, but you need to pull that every night because if you leave it, you're just going to get stuck and then you're, you're in the shit then. Because I know when I first come on here, the gang before I got on, they, I don't think they pulled it once and I had to take a lot of blocks out on the inside and get it out, so yeah, make sure you pull it every night and then you'll, you'll be fine. Keeps the cavities nice and clean. Okay.
go up to height. We've got a, a, a door surround on there, so. Just left the brickwork back and then. Um, I'll put that, it's like a full brick on it in there. slip ties and then it goes right around the door um, just start getting the block work up carry on with that tomorrow Couple of corners up, block work there. Trying to left. That side of the block work's done. So that in. And then we're just gonna jump and set up the brickwork on that side and then run all that in, same as that, and then do the back and the front. Right, so, other side's done. So that's that gable in, so I'm just gonna run this back in, get the brickwork up now. Set all windows out and then we'll jump up block work after. Head underwater, I'm falling back into you. I thought we'd be smarter, I got nothing left to lose. You said you fall with me, no matter how far it goes. Not deep and under. So the back wall's in. As you've just seen, that's done. I'm gonna start this block work here now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tail this wall out, this party wall, just so it's um, sort of ready to go. As I'm doing this, and it'll support this this block work and that then, as I'm doing it. But I just need to fill this bit in with um, the socks. Put, put a piece of damp there and then put the socks in. So we'll, we'll get that in now and then we'll carry on this block wall.
talking to you I thought we'd be smarter I got nothing left to lose You said you fall with me No matter how far it goes Down deep and under in started backing it up get this this course of briquettes on here in the morning get them formers in and then build them in with clips and then take up this to the nine courses and then we can start running these party walls in i set the bottom brick out on the on the doors around here just so it's gone off so when we go up because it's like stack bond so they don't start moving at the bottom and then we'll get them in tomorrow up to the top of that and then that's all done when you think next left so yeah Right, so we're getting on with this um, this party wall here. Um, I'm going to put one more on that and then leave the last two cores till tomorrow. I'm going to back it up. I don't want to go too mad with them. Um, first course, first course, we're already down. So like two, five cores on that. And then we'll, we'll just do. We'll back this up there. Get this side done and then I can just finish it off tomorrow. Because it's a quite heavy block, you can end up bowing with them. So I'll jump on the other side, get that in, and then we'll um, get these door surrounds in, then get all that done, and then just finish them off at next lift tomorrow. So yeah, we'll get that in. All block work done. Just need to join that up there, scrape the back off, give it a brush off, and then we'll get these door surrounds in, and then that's this this left on for now. So we'll, uh, we'll get that done.
Did you write? 